Hey guys, Garam Coach here from TryThisPlay.com. Guys, I'm not sure if you've been watching the playoffs this weekend. We had some crazy games, and the Saints and Vikings, that was insane, guys. I could not believe it ended like that. You know, at the end with uh, Kyle Rudolph uh, catching that push-off, controversial, no-call, touchdown. Um, I do believe the Saints got stroked once again. I, I feel like it was a missed call. You know, if you ever tried defending, uh, if you ever played corner and try and defend a wide receiver in real life, you know, it's kind of it's kind of hard to uh, make a play on the ball when someone pushes off to you. It's such a huge advantage that even the slightest push can uh, make the difference in catching that ball and breaking it up. Uh, however, guys, I do believe that was a missed call. Kyle Rudolph, his arm did fully extend, and uh, I feel like it was enough to... Uh, make that catch at the end for that uh, touchdown to win the game. But uh, guys, I'm here today because I want to show you, I mean, we've all been in the situation where we're playing a guy who runs gum bunch, max protecting all game, and you can't blitz him. Uh, so guys, you know, if you ever get your opponent on a situation that's like third and 15 or, or like fourth and 10, third and 10, and they're running gum bunch and they're max protecting all game and you can't stop them, guys, we're going to get some heat on the quarterback. And I'm going to show you how to do that. And we're going to be sending eight guys, but this is the fastest eight man blitz in the game. Even if they have escape artists, guys, it's really, really tough to get away from this blitz. So I want to hop in the four, four split. All right, guys, I want to go ahead and pick cover two invert. And we're going to max protect that a bunch. So, guys, again, in a situation where it's 3rd and 10, 4th and 10, you know, going up against a gum bunch player, they like to max protect. Guys, all we have to do here is blitz all linebackers globally and double press, guys. So, it should look like this, guys. Um, the whole line is crowded. Uh, everyone's on line. You might have to move this linebacker a little bit out right here. Uh, no big deal, guys. Um, it's not too hard to do. This is a fast setup. We're pressing everyone, and when they hike the ball, guys, they're going to get screamed at. As you can see right there, they really have no time. Now, you might say B's open, but guys, that route in verticals, uh, you can't quick throw that really. So, you know, it'll be going towards the sideline. So, again, blitz all linebackers. Um, move this guy a little bit out, and you can bring this guy down if you want. You know, play the middle of the field. Uh, you can even adjust your coverage if you have the time. Put these guys in deep quarters. Then we're just responsible for the middle of the field. So, but guys, again, they're not going to have a lot of time, guys, especially if you have fast linebackers in. They're really not going to have that much time to throw this ball if they're max protecting at a bunch. And, you know, you, you pull this out once or twice a game, that can be a difference from them getting a first down and you getting a stop. So, guys, if you sneak this in against someone who likes to max protect a lot, this is probably the easiest way to blitz eight out of any formation of the game just because we have four linebackers and four defense alignment in the box already. Uh, whereas other formations, you're going to have to bring down a safety. Uh, but this is pretty much set up for you since we're uh, one safety high to begin with. Uh, so, again, guys, all you have to do is just um, blitz all linebackers, uh, press, double press, and uh, bring this guy a little bit down if you want, if you really want that splits the screen. And they're really going to have no time, guys. So, again, you see we come right around the corner, sack, fumble. And, you know, that, that could be a difference between winning, winning a football game and losing. So, guys, if you haven't already, please visit TryThisPlay.com for more premium tips, ebooks, and coaching. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. If you like connected franchise mode, visit GamerHuddle.com where you can export all your franchise data via the Madden Companion app directly to their website. With amazing franchise analytics and peer-to-peer -peer wagering will be coming very soon.